town could hear us shouting me in. Oh, it cost, I know. A riddy, that was a brass, right enough. But the brass neck tended to be, what a brass neck. Um, I hope everyone's well. So there you are. We are, Glenn Peacock. Thank you so much. Glenn, Sheffield, when you were we, Bath night. Share, 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 folks. Now, come on. J-Dog says, dinky-doo. Uh, wonderful. Hope everyone's well. Yeah, we've got that. Scotty, the ceramics was 162 to 164 Argyle Street. Aha! The main street in Danoon. Wonderful. 164. Now, was that higher up? Was that near the old St. John's Church? Or was it further down near Bell's Corner? That sort of idea. There we go. What side was it on? We got shoved in the kitchen sink at the kitchen window. Some memories. I know that's right. Everyone's wings getting washed. Nobody bothered, you know, the rest of it. And Because uh, you didn't really have curtains and stuff like that. We had one, but you, you wouldn't need close it just because people were getting a bath. You know, that sort of idea. Got to go for dinner. Speak soon, dinky do, dinky do, J Dog. Have a lovely, lovely dinner and a lovely din dins, as you call it, and a bon appetit, mon ami, as we say, en français and en Ecosse. Um, so there we are, Dinky Doo, J Dog's off for his dinner. Scotty, when I was a toddler, my gran used to make me pee in the kitchen sink childhood. Trauma. Yes, grannies could do that. Come on, you you, you make a, a big noise there. That's good, boy. That's a, did anybody's gran lick their handkerchief and rub their face? Did anybody's gran spit on their hand and, and smooth your hair down? Oh! What a riddy. Catherine Raven, glad I'm not the oldest one to hear that, says he, class. I'm off to Sheffield on Monday, Scotty. Glenn, take the love of all of us to that beautiful, beautiful seven-hilled, seven-hilled city. Yes, ah, uh, Sheffield. It'll be warm today, Sheffield. Oh, it'll be roasting. You can get a fair heat going there of an afternoon. I thought I was in Greece, sitting up, having uh, a refreshment outside uh, over at the Manchester side. Yes, do you know where I am, Glenn? That sort of idea. Uh, a course, a smiling <laughs> Catherine, hello, says Green. By the way, I was very impressed the other night when you not only knew where the old homeopathic hospital was, but also that it was 1000 Great Western Road. Not many folk would know the exact address. Well, Gordon, I never went to it as a homeopathic hospital, but I think it was up in huge gold letters in the great big window above the massive front door. And that must have been somebody's hoose at some point. I wish I'd gone in it because I bet it was impressive inside just the scale of these houses. So it was just your normal front door, if you like, but about 10 times the size. <laughs> you know, imagine shutting the storm doors in these houses. And there was a lot of houses along there like that, you know, and I can remember further along, I was once in a play written by one of our directors about one of these houses in Great Western Road. And I'll tell you who else stayed there, I think, was... Uh, a. E. Picard, the impresario that owned the picture houses and uh, the Panopticon and all these things, the Panopticon. I remember the sheep dips, the Alistair Campbell. Oh, do you ever remember getting a kind of antiseptic -y shampoo on your hair? Do any of the guys remember getting their hair cut and all the wee jaggy bits down the back of your neck and then... The barman took some sort of grey, sticky, jelly stuff out of a bottle with a cork in it, rubbed it in his hands, rubbed it all over your hair, brushed it, and then your hair went hard. Unless it was raining outside and all around in your face with the jaggy bits. <laughs> my older sisters licked their hanky and washed my face, says Acos. I hated it! Oh, Acos, thank goodness you don't hate anything now. Because as we know, if you hate something, you're shutting off an avenue of learning. I'm wondering how many on here still pee in the kitchen sink, staring it upstairs to the bathroom. 
God, Robertson, raise your game. I say, fantastic. Well, we don't 